Okay, friends, so I'm going to try and take a stab at making homemade roti, which is like Indian bread. And um, yeah, I'm going based off my memory from what my mother-in-law did. And uh, I just watched her one time. She made this about, I don't know, maybe four times, five times while she was here. And it was the final fifth time that I actually stood there and watched her and helped her. Um, okay, so here it goes. Okay, so here is the whole wheat flour. I already put one cup in here. And she didn't really measure. She just cooks by eyeballing it. On certain things she measured out, but certain things she just eyeballed it, I noticed. So I'm just going to add enough salt that I would think would make it flavorful but yet not salty and then she added this oil it's called oh sesame oil she always they they call it a jig gidgily i think they say gidgily oil I guess that's how you say sesame in uh, their language. Okay, but I did see here put a little gidgily oil in here. Sheesh, I don't remember how much. We'll find out when he tries it out. Okay, and then... She did use some ghee, but it was, oh, it's still soft. It's not bad. So she did use a little bit of ghee. I'll add a little bit more just for good measure. And I guess you're just going to add water until it's the right consistency. Guess it's best to add a little at a time. Gotta make sure that clarified butter is uh, properly distributed. Okay, let me just use both my hands. I think this should be good enough. I think that's enough kneading. So I'm going to go ahead and cover it like she did and let it rest. Okay, I'm going to let it rest for a couple hours. So you actually forgot how to cook this, huh? <laughs> no, I forgot. So today we're going to have some chicken curry you see back there. And then I'm going to prepare uh, the roti. I'm not sure if we're going to do a side dish, those garbanzos or not, but it's definitely going to be chicken curry and homemade roti. Okay, so here's how it looks. <laughs> so far. Okay, so I get to take the very first, that's big, very first taste of the bunch. Oh, yeah, hot. Don't put it in your mouth. Right smells good. Good? No, put it back there. Very good. Nice and spicy. Okay, so I have my dough is ready to be rolled out. Get my stuff together. Okay, friends, so what I need to do now, I'm going based off of memory from the last 
very last time, I think it was a week before she left back to India, I actually did the process. She mixed the dough and all that together, I just did this part. So hopefully I remember. Yeah. Flower here. And let's see, I have my ghee. And it's a small amount just for us. So just put it into a ball. And uh, I think we dip it in here. And dip it in the flour. And I think we do this first. I think we roll it, roll it, roll it, roll it. I think somewhere along the way there's. Somewhere along the way, before I roll it, I think. And then she folded it. And then she added another thing of green. And then she rolled, folded it. I think. That's when she started to roll out. Oh my gosh. Too soft. So I'm not going <clears> to <throat> do it too hard. flour. But anyways, I'm just going to roll as many as I can with... Look, Ma! Tell her I'm making her recipe. Ma, I'm not sure. 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 Hi, Ma. This is friends, so now it's time to cook the roti, and you need to put some beans on the pan. And then pop in one of the roti dough. My assistant here will <laughs> show you how to, you have to keep watching it and don't let it burn and don't let it <clears throat> get dry on one side, don't let it fold and flip. Set a medium heat. Make sure you get the bubbles out. Clip. Get that more. Add a little bit more. Both sides. So it becomes soft. So it becomes nice and tender. Soft, pliable.
and bring it close to the camera when it's done. Headquarters for the UFO activity. But we have to investigate to see what they actually were doing here. Investigating Hitler's potential. Make sure all the parts are evenly heated. Cooked. It's like a tortilla. This is how it is. You keep more of them. Pop it up. Okay, so here's the end results. Nice roti with homemade chicken, curry, and some garbanzos. 